And hey there, what's up, I'm from the bit. And hey there, it's me, Mudlink. And welcome back to some more Fire Emblem Shadow Dragon. Last time, we made it through all the way, all the way through chapter one, took on Gazak and his crew of pirates. And Gordon is still her god. I still love what happened to Gordon last episode. Anyway, this time, chapter two, the pirates of Galder, more pirates. Yeah, like I said, uh, you know, first four chapters, we're gonna be a lot of accidents, so we're gonna be seeing a lot of pirates. Grr. One thing could always be said about Gal Galder Harbor, the mainland port nearest Talos. It never had much in the way of riches, but neither did it have much trouble. All that changed when a pirate crew fell upon the town and made it their hideout. Here in Galder, history records Marth's first steps towards freeing his homeland. Song so much. I love together be right. At least people that have never played Fire before recognize this song because of Smash. It's a great song. <laughs> Prince Marth, I am Ogden, mercenary of Talos. The king has bid me and my three men join your army. Cavalry has arrived in the west, flying both standard. They mean to take your life, sire. Be careful. Anyway, we have four units to talk about right now. Don't worry, we're not we're not gonna be getting there's not gonna be too many times we're gonna be getting a lot of units at once. It's like one of the few times in the game where we get like Oh shit that other one. Oh, sorry about that. It's still early in the morning. Anyway. First we got Agma, the fucking king right here. He's a mercenary and he's got himself 12 speed. He will double quite a lot early on. And will continue to double for a decent amount of time. He actually will start to slow down a bit as time goes on, but... But you know, uh... He's still he's still good overall in the early game because of all these pirates. My only issue with Agma is like on harder difficulties. He will not be able to double things, which means he will be kind of a bad unit. Not gonna lie, when he can't double, he's not a good unit because six strength is kind of iffy. And anyway, his growth are as follows: ninety percent HP, forty percent strength, zero percent magic, forty percent skill, thirty percent speed, forty percent luck, twenty percent defense, and zero percent res. So yeah, balance across the board in just 40, except for like speed. Like, he has a good base at least. So that's nice. But it's not gonna make him double everything. Since, you know, once we're out of pirate territory, it's all lances. And, I mean, when promote, when Agma promotes, then you won't have trouble against axes, but. Maybe lances, but. You know, you have to get them there to begin with. And honestly. I don't think I will. <laughs> Agma's decent at least. Like if you're playing on hard, like hard one, he's a good, he's a decent unit. You know, might as well use him. I'm not going to, just because I feel like it. Anyway, time for the fighter bros. We have three of them. Let's talk about the best of the three. Uh, we're probably not going to use any of them. It all depends, really. First, we got Barst. This is it's the best out of all three of them. He's got. The highest of these high highest about all of them. That's highest strength, tied for the highest speed, highest skill, highest luck, well tied for the highest luck, and highest defense. And highest HP too, he's just the best out of the three of them. He's got D rank and axes, so he hand axes at base, which is great. And overall he's just yeah, he's a, a really fun unit. And his growths are as follows, 80% HP, 40% strength, 0% magic, 40% skill, 30% speed, 40% luck, 15% defense, and 0% res. So yeah, hits hard, I'm gonna double a decent amount, but then after it's probably not gonna double all that much, it all depends really on how lucky you get. Yeah, he's best of the fire bows, but honestly, I don't really consider the three fire bros all that great to begin with. 
Forest is like the best of the three, which isn't really saying much because those are complete poo poo dog shit. But at least on this difficulty, you can sort of use the other two. But don't. I, I highly advise you don't use the other two. Anyway, uh, speaking of the other two, let's just talk about them. Bored. Fucking awful. Look at these base stats. Look at this fucking... It's C rank, at least you can use hammers. That's nice. Those armored bosses, but his growths... 90% HP, 55% strength, 0% magic, 45% skill, 10% speed. Yeah, you heard me right, 10% 10, 10 speed. 35% luck, 10% defense, and 0% res. Just the guy double aiming him? Haha, <laughs> you're very funny. Yeah, he's just complete fucking trash at board. On this difficulty and on hard five. Don't fucking use him. Ne never, never. He's, he's a boring, he's a, he's bored. You'll be bored using him. Unless we got Cord. He's, I guess, the, the growth, like the growth one. He has the best growth out of the three of them. But his bases are the worst of the three of them. Seven base strength and E rank and axes. That's what kills him instantly. Not being able to use hand axes at base. So at least Bored can use fucking hand axes. It doesn't have to get, like, we're just getting, like, doubled by everything. This guy, I guess, he won't be doubled by everything, but... Yeah, just, there's nothing really all that useful about Ward. He just doesn't hit all that hard. He can't double, like, he, even at base, he's like, oh, we can barely, he can barely not double that pirate. Can't double anything on this map. Just don't use, don't, never use Cord. Cord is better in the next game, but like, in this game, fuck no. Don't use him. Just don't. Anyway, that's it for the three fighter bros. Uh, Shido, go and talk to uh, Akuma. Akuma, princess. I never got to thank you for coming along with us. There's no swordsman I trust more. I've seen your strength. You don't need to thank me, princess. I'm just doing my job. Speaking of which, your father would flay me if you come if you came into any harm. Do me a favor and leave the dangerous fighting to me and my men. I don't need protecting Agma. I'm strong in the bandit wham and I've got another job for you. Protect Marth for me. But Princess. He's very important to me and the world, but mostly to me. So do as I ask, Agma. Keep him safe, and that's the first and last that's my first and last request. Very well, how could I say no to you? Thank you, Agma. I knew you'd understand. Alright, I have to go, but I hope we get to talk like this more. You're a good listener. Princess. Yes? You keep yourself safe too. Martha would grieve if anything befell you. Fair enough. Thank you, Agma. You're very kind. And that's the last time that Agma ever speaks. <laughs> uh, and these three actually never speak. In this game, if I'm correctly. Yeah, these three never speak. Anyway, um. Agma can run around this guy. And one thing I forgot to mention last time about these, they gave you a shit ton of experience. So that's good. Anyway, um... Also, thieves are not uh, programmed to be, um, like, aggressive, so don't worry about them trying to attack you. Most likely, they won't. Anyway, risk house visiting duty. A pirate calling himself Daryl wants to talk to your prince. It says he washes his hands of pillage and plunder and wants to fight for the good of all. Ha! <laughs> right. And I'm a farmer who's sworn off rain. Yep, as you can see, there's a guy called Daros here. <laughs> we'll talk about him when we recruit him. Don't worry about Chia being in range of him. Or anyone else being in range of him. As long as Martha's in range of him, he'll recruit himself. Fuck him up for any night rule. Doga, you just, um... Oh, I know. Gordon, you should've just stayed here. Fuck, I'm stupid. Ahoy, Prince Martin. I be Daros, a simple man of the sea. I have... I have me fill... 
fill out a pirate in life, and now I want to be looking to start in. What say ye? Make me your mate, and I swear to pull me low. Get the fetch the. Jay again, pl fetch the blue paint. Okay, you're going after Agma? Okay, but you don't, you don't get doubled by Abel. So what the fuck? Oh, wait, what? Okay, so this guy wanted to be. Wanted to be aggressive and decide to go up to Sheeta who fucking kills him in one round? Daros is right there. Okay. It's a weird thief. Anyway, let's talk about <laughs> Daros. He's so fucking bad. Look at his fucking base stats. Oh, they're so awful. They are so, they're literally worse than all of these guys. Like, look, look at him compared to fucking... The fucking board, like the worst of them there. Lower strength, two lower strength than board. Two lower skill, same speed. Two lower luck, uh, well, high, two higher luck, ooh, luck. Same defense. And one higher HP. Daros is fucking dog shit. He's absolute dog shit. But, I'm gonna be using him. Why? Because Daros becomes sale. Yes, I'm the only- he's my- he's gonna be one of my meme units. I don't give a shit. It's Daros. I'll fucking meme him. As, I'll fucking meme him, I don't care. He's just hilarious. I just love- I just love that Daros becomes sale meme. Yeah, his growths are as follows. 90% HP, 60% strength, 0% magic, 20% skill, 10% speed. 40% luck and 30% defense. All Unga Bunga, strength, and nothing else. He can use steel axe, he can use hand axes at least, so that's useful for him. Melee, uh, Abel. Curious gain experience whenever they use their staves. Uh, okay, that was, that was pretty fucking obvious, you know? Uh, Pirates also won't go for houses, so I don't worry about that. Go for Frey. Um, let's go here. Um, I kind of think I need to fuck off here, cause like you know, the archer, I can't. I don't think I can one on the archer, even if I use the wind spear. Nope. So no one's gonna get fucked, no matter what. So. I mean, hey, uh, Doga, come on, Doga. Wait, oh wait, oh no, <laughs> no, he's not gonna fucking kill Gordon. He's just, he's too strength. He's not fucking getting Gordon. Being able to double these parts, the phrase sucks. Uh, ouch. Uh, 69 here. I should use a lance here, it's fine. Yeah, I'm gonna go for that. He's gonna go for the house. Uh, Javelin, fuck. I was hoping it would do something. Stay here and deal risk. That's all you're useful for. Uh, what? You can attack him. Oh, this this guy. Never mind. Uh. Hit him, please. He's Lance. There you go. There you go, Sheeta time. She got HP, HP, strength, oh my god. HP, strength, skill, speed, lock. She got strength, that's actually amazing. Ah, oh, thank you. Oh, let's see, um... 
I'm trying to think of what to do. So uh, we're gonna go fuck off somewhere. Um, Doga's gonna get that. And is there any axes here? No. Um, rely on the steel axe. Come on. 66% hit. There you go, Doros. You will become sale. Yeah, there we go, Gordon, my boy. You just fucking yeah, not even doubling these guys more. That sucks for you. Okay, let's see. Uh, these fighter guys are not gonna do anything. They're just gonna stay around. Nice dodge. And Gordon's not gonna get that one. So that's good. Okay, um uh, Daros, do you think you can kill him please? There we go, Thank you. Board. There we go, board being useful, guys. Uh, there we go, shoot a level up. No, not shoot a level up, just shoot up experience. Remember, so you got a lot of healing to do. That's fine. Not of stuff we can buy there, but we're gonna get the house first. Hammers smash right through heavy armor. You should pick one up as soon as you get as soon as you get the chance. I mean, we got one, so it's fine. And just um, yeah, cord. Give your hammer. Give your iron axe to Daros. Never gonna fucking use you. Perfect, he's coming to me! Yeah, another recruitable guy, because, you know, has a name. Castor, is it you? It, it's you, it is you, isn't it? Must even good men like you betray Talus now? Princess Shida, oh, I'm sorry, but your mother's sick, and the medicine don't buy itself, see? So you agreed to fight for the pirates in exchange for coin? Alright then, if it's gold you need, take mine. Here, this is all I have, take it and go to your mother's side. But Princess, I betrayed you! Ugh, I've been a fool. Forgive me, princess. Let me fight for you now. My life is yours. And we never hear from her again. Here we go. Here is Castor. Another bow unit. He's a hunter this time. Hunters are... I don't remember the stat difference between hunters and archers. Hunters just feel like something different. And the hunter reclass... Uh, the hunter um, promotion is actually much better. The hunter promotion is much better than sniper. Because, uh... Well... You'll see. It's just, it's just good overall. Anyway, uh, I don't know. He gets a horse, basically. Which means, I mean, you don't have to worry about archers. Well, like, well, whatever. Anyway, um, fourteen, So there we go. I don't care, it's like we still have 13 years, is there a thing left? Might as well use it now, just so Ogma can die on this turn. Doros, you come sail. Oh shit, I meant to move Castor. That's fine, Castor only gets hit by one guy, so he'll survive the hit. It would have been funny to meme with Castor, but now... Oh yeah, his growths. Um... I have to mention those. 
A 40% strength, 40% HP, 40% strength, 0% magic, 40% skill, 40% speed, 20% luck, 20% defense, 0% wrath. 40, pretty much. He's alright, I guess. He's, he's much better bases than... Uh, much better bases than Gordon and Norn, that's for sure, at the very least. But, eh, I'm not really gonna use him. He's still a kind of, you know, still an archer. So, not all that great. There we go, Castor. Taking that hit for the team. That's about all you're gonna be used for. Run away, Agma. Gonna attack this guy with Freight just to get the level up. Skill, speed, luck. There you go, find finally getting more speed. Daros. Gum sail. I mean, I guess not yet. Eventually you'll you'll be sail. It's HP luck and res. Okay. I'm trying to see because I wanna get the kill to them Gordon. Oh, uh, Abel, you have you don't have yeah, you don't have enough strength for it, so. There we go, Gordon. Yee ha. You hit it. Ah, I hit it! Anyway. Now I have time to see in this armory. You get better weapons this time. Uh I already have a hammer, so we'll not buy it this time. Um, buy a hand, another hand axe. And buy another iron axe, I guess. That's about it. That's all I want to buy. Alright, all that's left is the boss and the village. Oh yeah, Castor Fox the Mark. Prince Marth, I am Castor of Talos. I wish to add my bow to your strength. Of course, Ka Cheetah told me all about you. You know, she's always been very kind to me, sire, even before I left Talos. And now, look how I've repaid her. Castor, you can still show her your heart is true. But the battles to come be what defines you. Yeah, and that will never happen. Sorry, Castor. Except not. You kind of, yours, yours is fucking terrible, just like the other archers, but you're not meme worthy. So. Yeah, you, you're just the worst of every. You're just the worst of both worlds, you know? Not even a good unit, and you're not even meme worthy to balance it up. Oh, my dear Prince of Altair, please, will you save Sister Elena? She's gone to, into the ghoul's teeth to tend to the stick there. We warned her, I swear we did. Lena's our angel, if something befell her, I, I know I won't think of it. Take this gold, we've 5,000 pieces. Just promise to use it to bring her home to us on our arms. Yep, so we're gonna watch out for a girl named Lena. Next chapter. And oh boy, I can't wait for that. Lena's a good, good, good girl. <sighs> ah, ten fucking speed. Oh my god, Gordon. Gordon gets doubled. Gordon gets doubled. Ah. He's so fucking fast. Jesus Christ, man. Man, even Agma has trouble. Uh, just bring everyone closer. Daros can, uh, Doesn't get doubled. Because he has 7 speed. Hey, Being useful for something, I guess. Not really. He won't be able to hit him. Okay, board, move out of the fuck. Cord, move out of the way. I can't even remember which who's who. He just. They just blend in together because. They both. They just both suck. The gall of ye, divine me crew. I'll put an axe square between your eyes. You ain't living here alive. I swear it on the rickety peg leg of Shanty Pete. There you go. Dodging hits. Oh, uh, I guess I'll, uh... Uh, come on, Silverlands. Fuck, you missed. Okay. 
Guess I have to do this. I'm gonna go after Jagan, okay. That's fine. Still miss Jagan, god fucking damn it. So terrible, Jagan. No, I'm just kidding. I love you. I love you. Anyway. I can't attack him on player face because he's gonna do too much damage to me. Okay, come on. Silver Lance. There we go. Uh Okay, yeah, Ogmon, you can just bring him down to one HP. And hmm, Daros or Gordon? Gordon. Oh no, but Gordon fucking gets one rounded and dies. Uh I Daros. There we go, Daros. Uh fiends you be. HP luck. Oh, you didn't even get strength. What the fuck, Daros? Whatever, that was the end of the chapter. Yeah, 26 minutes. A bit longer than the, the last episode, but you know. We had less units to talk about. Everyone's alive, right? I, I keep on thinking I killed someone and I forgot, but I'm pretty sure I didn't. And it's one, two, three. It, so that's it, said 11, 3, so 12, 13, 14, 15. Yeah, everyone alive. I don't know why I keep on thinking, oh, somebody fucking died and I forgot. I don't know why I always do that, but whatever. Map is over. You have our gratitude, Tyre, for finally chasing those pirates away. Now, as I hear it, it's you plan to march on to Oralis. That'll take you right, right, right up through the ghoul's teeth. With all due respect, Sire, you're taking a hurt risk crossing those mountains. That's mountains. That's Soothsire territory. The Soothsires are fearsome bandits, always raiding the villages and harry and travelers dare pass by. And the swordsman with them goes by the name of Navar. He's a terror with the blade, as they say. If you go up there and keep your wits about you, or you won't come back down. There you go. At the end of the chapter, so... Yeah, that was f that was a... That was a good chapter. A lot of pirates. Uh, we had a... Uh, we, really, we had a few close calls with the boss, but... Overall, it was fine. We got the Sailman Daros, and... The other units, I guess, that I'm probably not gonna use. Agma's still decent, at least for right now, because there's a lot of there's a lot of uh, pirates around, and there's a lot of uh, yeah, there's a lot of pirates. So, and not many people double them. So, uh, yeah, that's good at least. So anyway, that's it for this episode. Next time, we're gonna be getting uh, a really really good unit. I can't wait. See you guys then.